Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I clean my makeup brushes and beauty blenders using the Zote Soap Bar. That's right, the Zote Soap Bar. Now this soap bar you can find at the Dollar Tree, at the local liquor store, at your tia's house, at your grandma's house. Who knows, you might even have it at your own house. And it's a super, super, super cheap um, soap bar. It only cost me 92 cents. So if you want to know how this process is done, just keep on watching. Thanks. All right, guys. So here I have my dirty brushes ready to wash on my very dirty, dirty beauty blenders that I haven't used or washed in a long time and the Zote Zote Bar. So first step is to um, wet your beauty blender and wet your Zote Bar. Then you're going to rub that beauty blender onto the Zote Bar and make sure it has enough soap to really get those stains out. After that, I'm going to just rub and rub the beauty blender to really get in there and get the foundation out and whatever product is in there. After I rinse it and just keep massaging it to really get those stains out. You may have to uh, repeat these steps a couple of times just to really get all the product out and to make sure that the stains are removed and that it's clean. And if it slips away, don't, just go ahead and pick it up and start all over again and really clean that beauty blender. Now that I clean both beauty blenders, you can see that all the stains are taken out and they're ready to be used for the next time I have to do my makeup. Now I'm gonna start cleaning my makeup brushes and what I like to do is wet the brush, then rub it on the bar, use my hand as a brush cleaning mat because I don't have one but if you do you can actually use that then I just keep rubbing it and repeating the steps until all the product is removed and what I like to do after I rinse all the brushes is I like to squeeze the water out like I'm doing there and I like to move the bristles in a forward motion towards the gradient because I feel like it doesn't mess up the bristles of the brush Once my brushes and beauty blenders are all nice and clean, I'm ready to dry them. And what I do is I set them on top of a clean dry towel and I just let them dry overnight. And as you can see here, my beauty blenders are really pretty without any stains and I'm just so happy to use them for next time. Okay everyone, thank you for watching. This concludes my video and be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and please don't forget to press that big red button to subscribe to my channel. Alright, till next time. Bye!